Hello, today I will talk with you about name and save a file. Then we will talk about create and name a folder and how we can use save as, okay? First of all, I want you to know that if we open any program, we can create file from this program. Okay, we can create file from this program. For example, I am opening now paint program and your teacher asked you to do some works on paint program and then you have to save this work. Let's see together what will happen. For example, uh, the teacher said throw an oval, for example, just an arrow like this, some star, or uh, let's make this one. Okay, I have some shapes here and now we want to save. First of all, you know that you have to go to the menu bar, okay, from file and you will use the drop down menu. You will use the drop down menu. From drop down menu, you will use save as option. From save as option, just click on it like that. And now you will have this window. This window, we call it save as dialog box. Save as dialog box. From save as dialog box, you have to be aware about some things. First of all, you have to know where to save your file. You have to know where to save your file. Okay, you have to know where to save your file. Okay, as we said, you will choose from here the place where you have to save your folder or your file. First of all, I want you always to choose desktop. Okay, you have to scroll up from here so you can see the desktop. Click on it with your mouse. Now you have your desktop. Okay, from desktop, you have to check the file that you have to save your work on it, okay? The file that you have to save your work on it, the folder, sorry. I don't have folder for my work, for example. If I have exist folder, just double click on it like this, for example, double click on it, it will open for you, then you will save your file on it. If you want to create a new one, just you will go new folder, create a new folder from here, click on it. Now you have a new folder from here. Just you will use your backspace from the keyboard to rename the folder on a proper name for your work. For example, I will name it math because this is for the math homeworks or you can add your name so uh, if it's a shared computer with others Rowan for example math okay or you can keep it math as you want then I will click enter with my keyboard now I will go and here and open now it's selected okay it's selected you will click open now where am I I'm on the desktop inside math folder. I am on the desktop inside math folder. What I have to do now? Now I have to name the file. I have to give a name for the file. I will click with my mouse inside the box. I will erase it with the backspace. Then I have to give a name. For example, I will name it math shapes for example or you can mention it's a homework one homework two whatever you want then what you will do just you will click on save what happened look at my title bar my title bar changed for math shapes the name that i give it to the file now this file only it's it's here Let's minimize, I will minimize 
to check the math folder. Look, girls and boys, you have I have the math folder just that just I created now. Double click on it with your mouse and now maximize to make it bigger. Look, you have the file that just I save it now. Math shapes. Okay. Okay, let's revise now. As we said, you will go to the menu bar file. You will choose save as. From save as, you will go up to desktop. From desktop, you will create a new folder and name it where, with the name that you want. You want it. Or you can search for your folder from here as I just I created now math I will click open and then don't forget to name your file okay you can name it with your name or the lesson name whatever okay then you will press save so you can find your folder this is your folder and this is the file you save it inside it okay you can find the folder on the desktop like that. Thank you very much.